Angela Merkel opens her office doors for a look back at her 16 years as German Chancellor. The woman with a reputation for crisis management tells DW about her toughest moments leading Germany. The two events I personally found most challenging were, for one, the large number of refugees arriving here, which I actually do not like to call a crisis because people are people. So first, there was the pressure that we faced from many people fleeing Syria and neighboring countries. And now, there's the COVID-19 pandemic. Maybe these were the crises where we clearly saw how people are being directly affected, where human lives hang in the balance. And for me, those were the biggest challenges. Labeled the climate chancellor during her first term, she's been facing mounting criticism for doing too little too late to avert a global crisis. I've always done something. I only had to acknowledge that the scientific estimates were always worse and more awful, it has to be said, than was the case in the previous report. I tell young people that they need to pile on the pressure. We must get faster. We have to pay heed to the scientific estimates again, and that means sticking to global warming of 1.5 degrees. Glasgow has already yielded a number of results. But this is still going too slowly from young people's understandable perspective. Now Merkel is focused on a smooth handover to her likely successor, current finance minister Olaf Scholz. She took him along to all G20 meetings in Rome, a signal of stability beyond her own time in office. I thought it was an important signal for Olaf Scholz to be part of all bilateral discussions. That way I could say, seated right here is the man you will probably be speaking with at the next meeting in the role of German head of government. And I felt that was important, because many are keeping an eye on Germany. They want to know what's happening here. People are interested. If they get the impression that the current chancellor and the likely future one have a good working relationship, then that sends a reassuring signal in a rather turbulent world. I thought it was the right thing to do. If I may, it will be unusual to see someone else than you as chancellor after 16 years. You'll get used to it. Thank you.